So, a lot happens in this video. Bella's no kissing. And you're not ready. This is my shoes, man. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hello. <laughs> this is so weird. What the f***? Today, we are starting this video and probably filming the entire video at Kane's house because... I'm moving out and moving in somewhere. You guys have five seconds in the comments to guess where he's moving. You guessed if it. If you guessed my house, <laughs> then you would be correct. I already feel the comments, like people being like, That's weird, you guys. But honestly, at this point, I just don't even care. If you guys want the backstory, how far do we go back? <laughs> Wait, what, do we go back to like... I've lived in this house for like two years and I kind of got bored of it in the last six months and I was thinking about moving out. When Kane first moved here, it was like a party house. Like they would literally have parties every single weekend and all the people that used to live here don't live here anymore. So it's just a different vibe to when Kane first yeah. moved in. In a month, I would see people about maybe 10 times. It's just always empty. Your house has no one here ever. Do we talk about like... <laughs> So Kane just had a girlfriend, but he's a single guy now, so feel free to hit him up in the comments. He's taking applications, so just leave a little comment down below letting us know a nice fact about you that Kane would like. Kane was dating recently, and he was literally going and staying at her house, and then just coming to my house the next day and starting work, and never even coming back here. It would just be to do my washing or grab something, because I forgot it. What's the point in paying $400 to live here if you don't even like Do it, yeah. And even now that I'm not with Voldemort anymore, um, I still don't want to be here, and I, I just need some sort of change. Like, oh, you know what it is? I don't get my hair dyed when I have a breakup. I did get a haircut yesterday, though. <laughs> I just felt like I need some sort of change and it's definitely this place and I just want to get out of it. So Kane's moving in. We need to do like a full Q&A, like yeah. an updated Q&A. Oh, don't we? Ask us questions down below. And not everyone saw the TikTok. <laughs> the TikTok has been deleted, if you guys know. You know, and you should come follow us on TikTok yeah. so you don't miss out on things before we decide to delete them. Subscribe to the channel as well because we're doing a whole move-in series. Oh yeah, so this is day one of the move-in series. We have a lot of videos planned. I'm freaking tired. We've been driving for three hours today. Kane forgot the keys to this house so we couldn't freaking get in. <laughs> and then we had to go back and then we went to the place to get boxes, to pack the room up. Let's get packing. Where are the boxes? Oh, should we do like a little tour? It's your room. Oh yeah, true. Okay, Kane's gonna do a tour. <laughs> this is my hallway. Got some film pictures here. I normally would have my desk and everything here and this is where I'd edit the videos. The big bed, I'm gonna miss this bed. The first time I've ever had a king bed and I always used to think, oh, they're just so big and stupid. This is my bathroom. This is the coolest part about your room. This is gonna be like sad. I, I, Surely you never take baths though. <laughs> I've had three baths. In two years. <laughs> oh, and one of them was technically just for a video. I did have sex in the bath once though. <laughs> also, when I was filming the video. Oh my god, everyone um, knows now. <laughs> it sounds like you've just done some OnlyFans-ish. Here's the closet. My favorite feature is the kettle <laughs> up the top. Oh, you want to know my favorite feature? I feel like I can't say it, but my favorite thing has always just been like laying in bed. The shower is just open. You can't say that! <laughs> So we can show the view because I'm not gonna live here. One of my favorite things is the little pontoon down there. And, and parties down there. Yeah. We always have parties and barbecues. Wow, it's even sadder because it's such a pretty day. 1.15 right now. I feel like we may not leave here until like 11 p.m. tonight. <laughs> oh, do you know what's crazy? What? We're gonna take all these down. Shit! That's gonna take ages. ages. Yeah. I'll take those down when I get sick of doing all the other stuff. I can't believe that these 10 boxes cost $40. Kane thinks it's not gonna be enough. I think it's actually gonna be too many. It looks like Kane owns so much stuff. He doesn't own any of this like matching furniture. It all came in here. Same with the TV. He does own this mirror though, which personally I am very excited about bringing this over to my place. It's so big. First up, we're just gonna set up the boxes though. So cue the time lapse. I forgot to take my tablet today, and there's just one. <laughs> no, this is a, this is a different level of grody. So on the list, we have to do a little declutter of the closet. Seeing as this looks like kind of a big task, I'm thinking that we should start with something a little bit easier, like this dresser over here. It's literally the entire thing. I think is just a junk dresser. Like, surely you don't open this, Kane. I think we should try do this entire thing in 25 minutes. 
thought you were going to say five, and I was like, let's do it. <laughs> you think we can do this? Twelve and a half. We'll compromise. Okay. Twelve and a half. I just wanna see you, wanna be with you. Got my cable ties. <laughs> Why do you have cable ties, Kat? Um, because handcuffs just aren't as fun. Wanna see you, wanna be with you, and I wanna be with you, and I Okay, we just finished. We had like two seconds to go. I'm proud. We've only got the entire rest of the room to go. First box is done. Big day. Big dress up. <laughs> I have to be honest, I'm a little bit scared to open up most of these drawers. Why? There's just like a random assortment of things in the drawers. Like there is a beer in here. Like there might be stuff I need to blur. I don't know. Why do you have so many junk drawers? I don't know. I just don't want to get rid of it. <laughs> Should I go put this beer in the fridge though? Save this one for later. I'm going to take the film picks off. He's going to do the boring stuff. I know that I just said that I feel like we're gonna be here until like 12 o'clock, but I've changed my mind. It looks weird. It has like no personality in here, right? It's just like so different. I actually kind of like this wall looking super clean like this, especially with the plants over here. Not that it really matters because Kane's moving out, so it really just doesn't matter at all. <laughs> I just turn around and Kane's like, Do you remember these? <laughs> Oh, no, people are going to take that the wrong way. Inside the clip. I cannot do a time lapse of what's happening over here because it's too inappropriate. Kane Foster, you guys. Comment what you think's in the drawer. No, don't. Don't do it. I'm going to start tackling the bathroom, which I'm assuming is mostly out-of-date skincare. Prove me wrong, Foster. It's very empty. And this random coffee drawer that you... Do you even make coffee in here anymore? No, not anymore. Okay, this is actually pretty organized, but I feel like the only reason that it's organized is because he doesn't freaking use any of this stuff. Wow, what a gentleman. How is he single? Yeah, how He's am I single? He's whole little... That's yeah. fucking cute, pal. How do you steal toilet paper from my house? You have a literal lifetime supply. <laughs> Guys, this literally is how I left it when I organized it. <laughs> Love that. Time to take these down. <laughs> That's the closest thing to a real plan that you've got. Coming from you, you kill all of your men. I didn't say I didn't. <laughs> Please fit. <laughs> it doesn't fit. Pocket <laughs> turn up the television now. Set me in the corner now. Take the colors of bed. Don't you hear me out? I'm actually gonna order something to eat because I'm so hungry. All I've eaten today is a piece of toast and a fries from KFC. I kind of love going on Uber Eats at other people's houses and seeing what they have nearby. <laughs> And I'm doing my hair because I've been meaning to do it all freaking day and I just haven't. I'm not done yet. I know you're looking at me like I've done it badly. No, I'm thinking that it's gonna look quick. Oh. What kind of cuisine are we feeling like? I actually just thought that I wanted to get pizza. I saw that and it looks really Oh great. my god, that's what I saw too! <laughs> yes! We both just saw this exact same Pizza Hut advertisement. <laughs> I prefer to eat Domino's and pizza. <laughs> I love it how we both get sold on the Pizza Hut advertisement, but are now going to get Domino's instead. Can we do it on your phone? Because I think I'm not sure if I put the address in there properly. Oh, of course. <laughs> That's what they all say. While we wait for the pizza, I am going to go downstairs. We're going to try to clean out his kitchen, which it's just going to be all old, out-of-date food. I can already tell. It's just filled with fucking... Ew! Apparently it's worse than we thought. Like, is it alive? Heck y'all, there's a freaking cockroach. It's so like, the whole shelf is just gonna go in the bin then? Or? So after that discovery, I'm gonna go down to the lounge room and just sit down here while this guy can clean out his own kitchen shelf because that is disgusting. Sarah just asked, do you think there's spiders or cockroaches on this couch? I'm scared, I'm not even kidding. There is a little friend. I'm just gonna start removing all the stuff that I don't want to eat because there's cockroaches and moths everywhere, which is just gross. That's basically empty. <laughs> we have a quiet 
tried the pizza and I'm The last free. supper. <laughs> oh, it is. <laughs> I'm so hungry. We only ordered one pizza, but we ordered it extra large. And I'm gonna say, this is giving me just regular sized pizza vibes. So we got a vegetarian pizza, because Kenny's vegetarian, but I love his pizza. Plant-based fire breather. If you guys haven't tried it, try it. It's really good. Be with you right now. I feel like I have truly hit a wall. I may be borderline delusionally tired. I'm gonna start uncontrollably laughing soon. I could go with like six coffees, like straight in the vein, and I still don't think it'll pick me up. <laughs> it's been a like a crazy couple weeks. I don't think I've ever been more emotionally exhausted in my entire life and then still working at the same time and doing shit. I feel like we truly need to do like a big life update Q&A kind of video. Mm -hmm. I actually frequently think my life is great and then <laughs> within a month it's not. <laughs> like something will change. I will frequently FaceTime Sarah and her boyfriend and tell them something and they will say I don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm so sorry that's happened. My life seems so relaxing compared to games. <laughs> Next task is King's closet. He has told me that he doesn't wear like 95% of the stuff in here. So I feel like the best way to deal with it is to just take everything out, lay it on the bed, and then just like sort through so that he's not like carting stuff around that he's not gonna wear. So let's take some of this out. We also have all of this. I might even be bold enough to say, I think he's got more clothes than me. So all of that is also gonna come out and we're gonna figure out what he wants to keep and what he wants to donate. Dude, these shoes are cool. Why do you never wear these? Like literally all of them, like this plaid pair of Converse is so cool. Yeah, I know. I these need Converse, what the heck, dude? Oh my God, how many pairs of pants can someone have? For someone that roasts me all the time about how much I have in my closet, this whole section is literally just pants and shorts. Dude, you are such a hypocrite. I have nothing to say. <laughs> we just got invited to go somewhere for dinner, so we need to hurry up. <laughs> just watch the last clip before anyone speculates that Kane and I were kissing because I had no lipstick on. I just ate off all of my lipstick by accident and I have super pale lips. That was no kissing. Oh, I didn't, didn't need to tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> you really didn't need to tell me that. Oh my God. Call me Sarah Betts or is that a pile of clothes? Shut up. An actual huge pile. Like, I'm shocked. This is bigger than mine. No, it's not. I cannot believe that you had the nerve to roast me. I actually feel a little bad. How many boxes have we filled up? Wait, are we gonna have filled them all up? I think we're about to. I did not think that you had enough to fill up all of these boxes. Let's bag up these donations. I'll hold the bag, you shove the clothes in there. She was moving in summer. I just had to found clothes. <laughs> God, bro. Sarah Betts. <laughs> I did it again. How? I'm trying to write to write Voldemort. Sarah, what are you doing? <laughs> Common sense, bro. I didn't get a good angle. I am officially over this. Something just fell out of Kate's closet and hit me in the face. And I literally broke my skin on my face. Kane is in here over it. This is my shoes, man. <laughs> So this is the progress of the day. We have donation pile, and then this is all the stuff that came. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just thought of something. I'm deluded. And then over here, we have all of the stuff that Kane is gonna be bringing over. <laughs> this is how many clothes hangers he has. Holy ish. But anyway, we are gonna vlog this entire process. Tomorrow we are gonna hire our van and then just pick up all the boxes that we have here, head to Ikea. So make sure you guys subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys don't miss out and let us know what you guys thought of this video. Where should I move to next? You haven't even moved yet. <laughs>